As usual for this month, this is my facts about women in history for Women's History Month. The woman that I'm going to talk about today is the youngest that I have covered for Women's History Month. Her name is Sonita Elizaday. She is a 20-year-old Afghani rapper, and she turned her struggle into music and brought attention to a worldwide struggle that many of us don't know that's still going on. Born under Taliban rule in Herat, Afghanistan, she taught herself to read and write. Now, what many people don't know is during Taliban's rule in Afghanistan, Muslim women had very little access to anything unless they had a male counterpart to assist them. So teaching herself to read and write was not only a big deal, but it was also very dangerous. Sanita Elizaday is most well known for her 2014 viral song on YouTube called Brides for Sale. It was a song about young girls being sold into marriage by their families. Sanita Elizaday got international attention from the documentary bearing her name directed by Rakshari Galham Meghami. It was a documentary about how her mother was trying to sell her to pay for a bride to marry her son. The production paid $2,000 to Sunita's mother for Sunita's time during filming and also to keep her from being sold for the raising of money for her brother's wedding. The Sunita documentary premiered in November of 2015 at the International Documentary Film Fest in Amsterdam. It was also entered into the Sundance Film Festival and won the Grand Jury Prize. Because of the film's international reach, Elizaday is now living in the U.S. because of the Strongheart Group. And she is currently attending school in Utah on a full scholarship and continues to write music. Eminem is one of her biggest inspirations. Elizaday continues to advocate to end child marriage. One of her biggest fears is to see a world where girls are still treated as property, unable to create and imagine a bright future for themselves, and to see politicians not take action to end gender-based violence. But the fact is, Sunita Elizaday has changed the lives of many through her work and her music to end child marriage, not only strangers, but also in her own family. Her mother's views have changed and she no longer sees women as girls to be married off and to bear children. She no longer pressures Sunita's little sister to marry at such a young age. This has been this week's facts about women in history. I hope you guys had a wonderful Women's History Month. This is my last women's video for the month. So I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys had a wonderful March and a wonderful day. Thank you so much for watching.